subscribe science on youtube for more videos hello guys welcome back to this science on youtube channel please subscribe this channel for more videos so today our lecture is about the how to find the volume of any object in this lecture we are going to tell the method how to find the volume of any type of object of any kind of object so uh, let's consider this is any object given to us and uh, this is any it may be a wood object it may be a metal object and the dimensions are also known to us uh, this is the one side of the uh, object uh, consider this is the width of the object it is presented by b it may be of any uh, uh, dimension for example it is five meter right so this is another dimension and the length wise this is in the width wise this is the length wise and this dimension is also given to us this this length is suppose it's eight meter right for example i'm just supposing this dimension from myself and the consider the depth of this uh, object is uh depth we can represent it by h and it's equal to the two meter so this is a three dimension object uh, in which the three uh, different uh, dimensions are given the depth the width in this direction the length in this direction and the depth in the height so we are interested to find the volume of this object so to find the volume volume uh, we have we should multiply these three dimensions with one another the width with the length and with the height this width this length and this height when we multiply these three quantities we will get the volume for example the five meter is the width the eight meter is the length and two meter is the height all these units should be in one uh, uh, in one format for example uh, we use meter so all units should be in meter if we use foot so all units should be in foot so now the volume is equal to the if you multiply these uh, of three quantities so it comes out to be 80 meter 80 cubic meter the volume should always be in the unit of cubic in the cubic meter because uh, it includes the three dimensions of the any object uh, the three dimensions the one the second and the other one the height so that's why it should always be in cubic it may be in cubic foot uh, cubic foot like in this one it may be a cubic inch are the centimeter cube but it I should always be in the cubic uh, because it includes the three dimensions so this was the today topic about how to find the volume you can also find the volume of any type of object if you known if you find these three dimensions so just multiplying these three and with the unit of cube so you will get the volume of any object and don't forget to subscribe our channel for more science videos thank you for watching our video